I got light now. All my fucking vlogging at night has been solved. Damn, he got that new Desport fucking uh, splitter. I changed an exhaust gasket for this shit. <laughs> he was like, "Hey man, if you can if you can change the exhaust gasket on my header, I'll give you the Desport splitter." I was like, "Fuck yeah!" Dave always began these weird ass deals that like be like benefiting him in the end. Well, anyways, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Um, I'm gonna be doing an oil change on my car because tomorrow I'll be going to Race Legal. If you're from San Diego, you know what Race Legal is. So I'll be seeing everybody out there. Tomorrow's gonna be a pretty good meet. It's gonna be a pretty big, actually, uh, turnout. It's been anticipated for about a month and a half or so. The date was changed in the first place because um, it started raining the day that we were gonna have that meet and. You know, drag racing and rain isn't a really good combination or whatever. Drift yeah, right? No, it's fucking drift lube and burnout lube. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm going to change my oil. Um, and I bought spark plugs, but I'm not going to do them here. I'm going to see if Dave's going to be kind enough to let me borrow his uh, front rims off of his drag car, wheels. which are the K. All right. The wheels. wheels. Biggest I'm sorry. Biggest ever when people are like, damn, check out these rims. So technical Boy, they over ain't here. rims, they're real. So technical over here. Anyways, he has our triple eights on them, so if I do race, I'll have a lot better chance of winning because I won't have any issues with traction. So, we're gonna get to it. This vlog is most likely gonna continue on to tomorrow since today is Thursday. I work tomorrow, so it's gonna suck. I'm supposed to be at the place because I'm VIP with a couple other people that are representing their whole crew or whatever. So I'm VIP. Um, I gotta be there at five, but I don't get out of work at, till like six. So yeah, we're gonna see what, uh, what happens with all that. And um, like I said before, it's just gonna be a good time and we're gonna try to enjoy it, all right? So I'll see you guys uh, when this thing cools down. Look at Dave. My bucket sees way easier to get into. <laughs> what, what did you buy? What side of the car is right here? Oh, that's uh, from this side, it looks like a right hand type car. <laughs> he guessed it right. And it is, of course. <laughs> This dude goes, watch this, he goes, push the button. He goes, push this button, right? Right. Oh shit, I gotta turn it off. Ready? <laughs> Yo! <laughs> <laughs> That's what that little button's for. I got that yeah. shit too, but I don't know what it does. Yeah, let me see. <laughs> Here, he's talking about this button right there. Like. Right, oh, right there. That button right there on the little block. That's where I do my mirrors, since it's electrical mirrors. This little box right here, down right there. You press it and it'll fold the mirrors and unfold them, which is dope. Boom, his drag car, my car. With the cozy's back on there? It's a, it's a hop down memory lane seeing this shit back with cozy's on. Oh my god. No, I don't hit, dude. No? Nope. Oh Let's my fucking god. Check it out. Just leave it hanging, see if it hangs. <laughs> Yo, that is sick. 38. That is sick. I'm telling you, bro, they're going to look good with, with. I ain't going to say it. But the, oh, yeah. I know. Those but things? They don't know. Yeah. I know, but they don't know. But they don't know. That's just going to look good. Everything should be good for uh, race legal tomorrow. I'm probably gonna change the spark plugs um, tomorrow before uh, race legal and stuff. But um, yeah, I borrowed his uh, his K1s. They look so sick. They look incredible. The fitment on them is on point. So I'm really happy about that. And uh, I'll finally be able to catch traction tomorrow in this parking lot. I'll be racing it. <laughs> What's up guys? Hope y'all are having a better morning than I am. Tonight's race legal, and uh, yeah. So pretty much, I woke up this morning. You know, 
about to go to work, everything was fine. And then uh, all of a sudden I have my neighbors tell me that the Evo got broken into. So I'm like, okay, well, it's not that bad. They probably like didn't break anything. Um, I'm not really worried about it because I'm not really a materialistic person, but you know, it's kind of shitty that things like this happen. So I'll show you guys what, what happened. So here's some glass on the floor. There, that's my whole fucking back window gas tank that I had in my back seat. I had I had a bunch of tools back here. I had Mikey's racing jacket. And I probably had like a couple of other things in here as well. I can't really remember, but it is so fucking shitty that people break your fucking window to get tools and shit. Like what the fuck? I'm not really like stressed that much out about it, but I am stressed about it because they did break into my car. So now I gotta file a police report. I gotta see what my insurance could do. I hate this shit. And I don't know. Fucking, I'm pretty upset about it. So I'm gonna see what I could do. I'm probably gonna go buy some new tools and everything right now. I don't know, keep them at my house or some shit. Sucks. So that's what I have to deal with this morning. Hope you guys are having a better morning than I am. <laughs> well, at least one of my cars are running. End result of the whole thing this morning, um, I had to pay like 300 bucks to get a new uh, window. They didn't even steal much out of the car. Like, they stole my toolbox, which was like, probably the most valuable thing that they stole. That, a hoodie, and uh, one of my boys' uh, racing jacket. Let's hope that race legal uh, brings up my hopes. <laughs> And uh, at least I didn't bring into the hatch, you know, because I'd be probably even more pissed. I just wish that uh, people had more respect for other people's properties. But this is the world that we live in today. So just be careful out there, guys. Always have an alarm on your cars and uh, always try to do whatever you can to prevent any theft or anything happening. I just got off work. Uh, and it's race legal right now. Um, yeah, let's see what this event's uh, all about and everything. Hopefully, uh, I don't break anything on the track, and uh, hopefully, they actually let me race. We out here with my boy Ben. <laughs> yeah, enjoying race legal and everything. Everybody's enjoying themselves. We got all the cars out here. All these cars representing their crew, all VIP. And then behind the rope, you got everybody else. You got the whole crowd and shit. That's dope. My car. Got a Supra next to it. Couple FRS's, Suvi. There goes Mikey over there. And then this red Evo over here, you can't launch for shit. <laughs> Alright, so I made it through tech, thank God. And uh, I just told him it was trailered, so shh, don't tell nobody. But um, yeah, uh, right now I'm gonna get my number, uh, which is a long ass line to get your number. And after that, I'm probably gonna ask Mikey for some tools so I can change out my spark plugs. And then uh, after that, we should be able to hit the track. My shit's slow, I don't really expect that much out of it, but hopefully uh, it runs good without any problems and make some good runs and hopefully a decent time. So yeah, let's, uh, let's pray for that. <laughs>
nine six. Not bad for uh, for what it is. Paul's back in the vlogs. <laughs> Haven't seen this guy in forever. He's been all depressed about his uh, his Evo being down, but he hey, it's fixed now. Got a new tranny. Things shifts like butter. Great, awesome deal. I ran twice so far. Um, both times I've just been spinning first. I need to like just feather it or like launch at about three or so. Um, I'm probably gonna do that next time. Um, so let's hope I grab traction and I get a better time because I've been getting nine six was my first run. The second run was ten. It was ten flat. I don't I don't really know what to say. It's just I gotta get used to it. Gotta feather it. It's not like an Evo at all, obviously. But uh, yeah. All right, guys. So. Mikey's last run, he took up all my fucking memory, so I had to delete a little clip or something <laughs> to make some fucking, yeah, bro, to make some fucking space. But uh, besides that, it was a good night. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed, as always. And this car meet was, uh, was really good, really good. Um, it was really big as well, so, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Deuces. One love.